All right, people, this is live, uncut, unedited. A 13-year-old just been shot probably about five minutes ago, carried by CPD to the hospital. Um, I think he was shot in the lower, lower body. So I'm on my way over to the crime scene. Police helicopter. We got a person shot, uh, 82nd and Coles. We got a person shot, I think on 100, uh, 104th and Avenue A or something like that. I think we got another person shot somewhere in Inglewood too as well. Police are saying the shooting happened near the corner of 82nd and South Cole around 9.30 last night. They believe a person in a red Jeep Cherokee fired those shots. Now, 13-year-old Swayze Rankin was hit in the back and abdomen, collapsing on the ground. He was rushed to Comer Children's Hospital in a police car and is listed in critical condition. What's going on? This is my life in the shot. I'm your host, Donald Washington. That's young 13-year-old Swayze Rankin. He was with his cousin who was 14. They was coming from a friend's house walking home Monday, April 26th. That's young Jemai Lamaya, 10 years old. She was shot six months ago, two blocks away in South Chicago, where this happened. This happened on 82nd and South Coles in South Chicago. Um, I want to bring you guys to the news footage from her. Before I do, I want to take you guys on to where this happened. Now, I was scrolling through some of the Facebook posts and reading some of the, uh, art, some of the reactions. Somebody said, I don't understand why people still live there in Chicago. And somebody was saying, yo, it's 930 when the streetlights came home. My mother was like, yo, that's your ace. Somebody put uh, Chicago where the killings are at the highest of the children. So BLM concerned, do nothing. See that all day. Where are the riots? Leave these crime infested areas. Leave, leave. Leave. Yeah. I'm going to take you guys to, um, before I take you to the rest of this news footage. Um, I'm going to take you guys. News, a 10 year old girl has been shot and injured at a South Side Park. Brittany Garzillo live outside Comer Children's Hospital with the very latest. Brittany. Corey and Don, that 10 year old girl was shot in the back and is now here at Comer Children's Hospital in serious condition. Here's what we know. Chicago police say the 10 year old girl was with a group of friends in a park at about 815 tonight in the 8300 block of South South Shore Drive when a person known to police approached and fired shots. The girl again was shot in the back and is now taken here to Comer's Children's Hospital in the police are still continuing that investigation. So far, no one has been shooting. It happened two blocks from where Swindle, he's also listed in critical condition. Now, the mother of the 13-year-old told me last October, her son saved the girl who was shot in the back. Swayze took off his shirt and tied it around the girl's wound to stop the bleeding. That shooting happened two blocks from where Swayze Rankin was shot, and his 14-year-old cousin was also shot last night. Now, Swayze's mother, who says the officers responding are the reason her son is alive right right now can't praise you enough i'm just waiting to get badge numbers and names because from my understanding when something like that happens you're not supposed to move the body at all those officers was quick thinking and they were not going to wait for that ems and they got him right on time so i'm highly grateful for you guys we the, we are the example for the young kid. so i also want to bring you guys to um Actually, before I do, I'm going to bring you guys to some of the stats coming out of South Chicago. The count is at one dead, 22 injured right now. So, yeah, this is it here. This is, um, so let me see. We got South Chicago, one dead, 21, 22 uh, total. This is what, April... Every two hours, 45 minutes, somebody shot. Every 14 um, hours, 15 minutes, somebody is shot dead. I want to bring you guys to seven-year-old Jaslyn Adams. Listen to this. It's going to still be a real number. Like, put your baby before gang. I'm not going to die for my baby, bro. Like, I'll die, I'll die for the guys. Did this dude just say, I'll die for the guys? Like, 
put your baby before gang. I'm not gonna die for my baby, bro. Like I die, I die for the guys. Oh my God, this dude. A real number. So they did catch the second suspect. He is charged first degree murder and two counts of attempted murder. Demond Gowdy, 21. That's his picture right there to the left. They are looking for a third suspect in the killings of seven-year-old Jaslyn Adams. They will find him. They will charge him. Unfortunate. One, two, the other cousin. Three, seven-year-old, four. How many babies? This is why I say we are in a state of emergency in this entire country. When our babies, when I do a report, three of them a week almost, on babies, 10, 13, his cousin, 14, 7. There's a three-year-old, there was a two-year-old in Lakeshore Drive. <sighs> Unbelievable. Anyway, those of you on Facebook, go to YouTube, go to My Life in the Shy, hit that like button on YouTube. Share this video, like, subscribe, let me know what you think, comment, I read them all. Peace, peace.